What's the fastest that a spacecraft has ever travelled? If we're talking about satellites going around Earth, the fastest ones are those in the lowest orbits. The International Space Station, which is about 227 nautical miles, or 420 kilometres above the surface, moves at about 17,500 miles per hour, or 28,000 kilometres per hour. If a spacecraft orbits much lower than that, it'll skim the outer layers of the atmosphere, which will slow it down so that it'll eventually re-enter. So 18,000 miles per hour is about tops for Earth orbiting satellites. To escape Earth's gravitational pull altogether, a spacecraft has to reach a speed of 7 miles or 11.2 kilometers a second. That's about 25,000 miles per hour, or just over 40,000 kilometers per hour. The fastest that humans have ever traveled in space is just below Earth escape velocity in the case of the returning Apollo 10 astronauts, when their capsule reached 24,791 mph, or 39,897 kilometers per hour. The highest speed of re-entry into Earth's atmosphere was 46,100 km per hour by the Stardust probe on its return in 2006 from Comet Wild 2 with samples of cosmic dust. The highest speed of escape from Earth was 58,500 km an hour in the same year by New Horizons as it departed on its way to Pluto and beyond. When we're talking about the speed of spacecraft, it's important to be clear about what the speed is being measured relative to – Earth, the Moon, the Sun, or some other object. Galileo was travelling at more than 173,000 km per hour relative to Jupiter when it entered orbit around the giant planet in 2003. Thirteen years later, the Juno space probe entered Jupiter orbit at 209,000 km per hour. But the current spacecraft speed record is held by the Parker Solar Probe. Launched in 2018, its mission is to study the Sun's outer corona from an incredibly small orbit. In 2021, it reached a speed of 587,000 km per hour, or 365,000 miles per hour, relative to the Sun's surface. In 2025, it will approach the Sun to within 6.9 million kilometers, less than 10 solar radii, at which point it will be traveling at 690,000 km per hour, or 430,000 miles per hour. That may sound fantastically fast, but it's only 0.064% of the speed of light. If the Parker Solar Probe were to travel to the nearest star, Proxima Centauri, four and a quarter light years away at that speed, it would take it over six and a half thousand years to get there.